Hi, I'm Dr. Neela Mohan, Director of Pediatric Gastroenterology, Hepatology and Liver Transplantation at Medanda the Medicity, Gurga. World Hepatitis Day is celebrated on 28th July to increase the awareness of viral hepatitis and this year the theme is One Life, One Liver. Just like you have one life, you have one liver and hepatitis can devastate both. Did you know that 300 million people across the world suffer from chronic hepatitis B and nearly 60 million from hepatitis C? In India, 3 to 4 percent prevalence of hepatitis B and C is seen. Globally, 8,000 new infections happen every day and 1 lakh deaths happen. Dear friends, it is time that we need to increase this awareness of how we can acquire hepatitis B and C so that we can reach the goal of elimination of viral hepatitis by 2013. Viral hepatitis commonly is either A and E which is acquired through contaminated food and water and their acute infections. Hepatitis B and C are the one which lead to chronicity, cirrhosis, cancer and death. And these infections spread like HIV that is through contaminated needles, finger pricks, instruments, whether it is piercing your ears, nose piercing, tattooing, dialysis machine, dental problems, filing your nails, so shaving etc. Now what happens is a dried sample of hepatite a blood in that also the virus can be alive for almost a week for hepatitis B and up to six weeks in hepatitis C. So besides protecting yourself from this contaminated needles, finger pricks etc. It is time for you to understand that the next most common route is a vertical transmission from mother to baby and the third transmission is by unprotected sex with an infected individual. So I want to emphasize each women out there who is in the age of pregnancy please screen yourself with hepatitis B and C and in case you are positive then in the last trimester of pregnancy we can give antiviral therapy to the mother to prevent transmission to the baby. Similarly, when the baby is born we have to give immediately hepatitis B vaccine and hepatitis B specific immunoglobulin to the baby. Sadly, we don't have any vaccine for hepatitis C Therefore, it is a must to diagnose in the mother and use antiviral in pregnancy to prevent transmission. So dear friends, let's take a note. Together we can eradicate hepatitis from our country and globally.